This is Bishop C.D. Miller. Glory to God. How are you? I'm coming today with the word of the Lord for you. Uh, the Lord has stopped me in the middle of my day, and upon my heart has come a sound of the Spirit. I'm reading today from the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 1, and it reads this way. I'm going to take my time and read it slowly for you. These be the words which Moses spake unto all Israel on this side, Jordan, in the wilderness, in the plain over against the Red Sea, between Paran and Tophel and Laban and Hazaroth and Dezaev. There are eleven days' journey from Horeb by the way of Mount Seir unto Kadesh Barnea. Verse 3. And it came to pass in the fortieth year, in the eleventh month, on the first day of the month, that Moses spake unto the children of God according unto all that the Lord had given him in commandment unto them. After he had slain Sihon, the king of the Amorites, which dwelt in Heshbon, and Og, the king of Bashan, which dwelt in Astaroth and Edrei, on this side Jordan, in the land of Moab, began Moses to declare the law, saying, The Lord our God spoke unto us in Horeb, saying, Ye have dwelt long enough in this mount. Turn you and take your journey. Go to the mount of the Amorites and unto all the places nigh thereunto, in the plain, in the hills, and in the vale, and in the south, and by the seaside, and to the land of the Canaanites, and unto Lebanon, unto the great river, the river Euphrates. The word of the Lord is found in verse 6. The Lord our God spake unto us in Horeb, saying, Ye have dwelt long enough in this mount. The word of the Lord for us today, in my reflection, the sound of the Spirit that's coming to me, is enough is enough. And from this place, you've been on the back side of the mountain, and I hear the Lord say, turn you and take your journey. You're getting ready to get a direction and a pathway, a clear rite of passage into the big hills, into the vale, into the south, and by the seaside, and to the land of your Canaan. Amen. And to that great river, even the river of Euphrates. Your stream is turning into a river. You're getting ready to launch into the overflow. And God is agreeing with you. Enough is enough. I don't know about you, but I've had enough. And I'm ready to walk into Canaan. I'm ready to walk into the land that God has promised me. And the word of the Lord is, it says, you have dwelt long enough on the backside of this mountain. Turn you. And take you this journey into your promise. Manifest God's promises now. I'm believing it. I'm receiving it. I'm taking it because I've had enough in Jesus' name. Amen. That's my word. I don't know about you, but I'm going to embrace it and keep it in Jesus' name. Enough is enough. And God is agreeing. Get up from this place. Arise and take your journey into that which is new has been promised. In Jesus' name. Amen. This is Bishop. I would love to send you my daily devotional. Sounds of the Spirit. Please subscribe at bishopcdmiller.com. Look for the left gold button at the top that says devotionals. And send us your email and I'll send you a sound of the Spirit daily. God bless.